Hey business owners, Craig Carr. Can I give you a real simple strategy? 68% easier, cheaper, and more effective than getting a new customer. And it's just one word. You've heard it before and you know it well. It's called an upsell or upselling. So what is an upsell? A lot of times I work with organizations that upsell, that's the kind of do you want fries with that? Well, actually it's not. The do you want fries with that is a cross sell, not an upsell. An upsell is when they buy more of something that you are selling. For example, they're looking to buy one and you've got an offer or an option where they can buy three or half a dozen. That's an upsell. Or they upgrade to a better, larger, more up-to-date version of what they're already looking at. So an upsell is we get them to buy more of something or we get them to buy the better or more expensive version of it. Now, as long as we're on this subject, why don't we talk about the other, the cross-sell as well. And the cross-sell is the do you want fries with that. So that is something in addition, something of value to the client to the prospect that goes with or is complementary to the product that they're already buying. Now, the stats on this are interesting too as well because 34% of people, that's customers that are already buying off you, 34% of them will buy the additional add-on product, the cross-sell product. But here's the caveat, provided you ask them to. So 34% of them will buy it, but you've got to ask them in the first place. And that's so important to remember because a lot of times I say, well, Craig, nobody asks us for that other thing. Our customers don't ask us for that other thing. No, you've got to ask them. You've got to make sure that it goes with it, but then you've got to ask them, would they like it? It's not that hard, just offer it. And 34% of them will say yes. So the question is, do you have a dedicated, process-driven, standard procedure for upselling and cross-selling in your business? And do your staff know them? And are they using them? This is a way to massively increase the profitability and the revenue of your business. And here's the thing, without it costing you a cent, now, how can I say it doesn't cost you a cent? Because the customer's already there. They're already there to buy whatever product, and now you're talking about a little better version or more of them or something else with it. That's where it affects your bottom line immediately. Look, I believe it's so important. I've actually dedicated a chapter to this in the new book, How to Unlock the Profit in Your Business. If you wanna know how to make upselling and cross-selling part of what you're doing, why don't you click the link and grab a copy of the book? Here's the thing, if you're not even sure where to start when it comes to upsell and cross-sell in your business, and you certainly don't wanna cross that line where you start becoming pushy and over the top with your customers, Click the link, book a few minutes with me in my call schedule, and let's see how we can make this a part of what you're doing. So remember, 68% more effective than trying to get a new customer, and 34% more in sales if we just know the right kind and time to ask the right question. Are you making this work for you?